Hey y'all, welcome back to our channel, or welcome if you are new. I'm Stephanie, and you're watching Steffi K's Farm Family. Today, I have a Sam's Club haul for you. I went to Sam's Club. I did not go to Aldi this week. I kind of wanted to stock up a little bit in the bulk things, so I think somebody's watching me through the door. <laughs> um, so I went to Sam's Club today to get a lot of groceries, and I got a lot of groceries. And then, um... I went to Ollie's because we were out of coffee. I needed coffee. And I got more stuff there. You'll see it. And then I had to pick up some stuff at Walmart that I couldn't get anywhere else because I just couldn't. I just couldn't bring myself to pay the high price for almost the same thing. So I'm going to get on to the grocery haul now. Um, stay tuned after the hauls. I will have my meal plan for the week. A lot of this stuff I already had. So. I don't know. I didn't have to buy a whole lot of that stuff, but I did buy tons of stuff. You'll see. You'll see. Okay, let's get to the grocery haul now. <laughs> All right, y'all, we are back from town today. Um, I went to Sam's Club, I went to Ollie's, and Walmart. And those are the only places we went today. Um, I spent 490 something dollars at Sam's Club, but I got a lot of stock up that's gonna last us more than a week. I'm going to turn y'all around and show y'all what we got at Sam's Club. i got to hurry up because a lot of this stuff's cold and it is hot today. So we got to get it put up really fast. Okay, here is what we got at Sam's Club. I got some plain Ruffles chips. Sun, the Harvest Cheddar Sun Chips. Out of the way. And I've just got my other stuff laid back here. So y'all just have to pay no attention to that. Some Crunchy Cheetos. They should pick those out. And then I got some uh, flaming Hot Hot Fries. A gallon of the whole milk, a big thing of pancake mix, a cantaloupe, um, a thing of ramen, the two, one time I had to get them in a two package of sharp cheddar cheese, a big thing of string cheese. They're over there smelling the perfume. Hold on. Alright, I got a big thing of sausage, hometown original sausage, the Smithfield kind. A big two pack of pepperoni because we go through these. Sage likes to snack on them. We all like to snack on them. So, uh, the candy hearts, grapes. Those are sages. <laughs> Uh, some strawberries. They had those for $2.98 and it was, uh, let's see, two pounds. So two pounds of strawberries for $2.98. I didn't think that was too bad. Buffalo style chicken breasts for sandwiches. Hey y'all, this lunch meat needs to go ahead and be put up. And then a two pack of ham. Yeah, I think it's ham. <laughs> yeah, ham. Uh, that one can go in the freezer. That one definitely needs to go in the fridge right now. Mm -hmm. A big thing of the Kraft Singles, some Red Hot Boneless Chicken Bites, a four pack of Pillsbury Cinnamon Rolls, a big box of battered mozzarella sticks, a three pack of Red Baron Pepperoni Pizzas, a 37 count Taquitos, a 20 pack of the Ham and Cheddar Hot Pockets, Tyson Homeless homeless <laughs> a boneless chicken box <laughs> oh my word it's been a long day uh butterfly shrimp a 24 pack of mountain dew and yes i got a bunch of junk food too a big thing of the california oranges these oranges are huge those are like 10.98 a bag but it's a big huge bag and they're huge oranges powder donuts a bunch of bananas, a pineapple, a bag of lemons because I'm going to make some homemade lemonade. And I've seen people haul this and I thought we would give it a try. It's the fried pickle and ranch dip. <sighs> and then this is for the 4th of July. We're having a cookout over here. Loaded potato salad. Got two three pound boxes of that. Here goes my junk food. Honey buns. Nutri-Grain bars. It's the strawberry, blueberry, and apple cinnamon. And then um, 48 or two 24 packs of Pop-Tarts. Got cherry and blueberry. Alright, I'm going to have to move some of this out of the way. Let's scoot it over here out of the way. Hey, can one of y'all put this in the fridge? Does it definitely need to go in there too? get my apples. I got a big thing of gala apple. The gala apple. I don't know how to say it. It's apple. 
and I give it a pecan pies. And then I got the patriotic Twinkies and cupcakes. And then, let's see back here, I got two big boxes of pork egg rolls. Here's some more junk food. Big Texas cinnamon rolls. Alright, go ahead and grab some more of this cut stuff and put up. Got that in the sausage. Any, like, meat stuff, because we don't need it yes. ruining. Yeah, that goes in the fridge. They had it in the fridge, but... Uh, a big, let me see, 15 pounds of potatoes. These potatoes are huge. So they make good bacon potatoes. A two pack or two loaves of the Wonder Bread. About all they had to choose from. We're fixing to start school in about five weeks. So I went ahead oh, yeah. and got, yes, we are. Five weeks we are. That's five weeks from now. We'll worry about that. <laughs> well, I'm trying to get stocked up a little here and there. So. 750 sheets of printer paper because I'll be copying some work off for them. Some bagels. We bagels. found these. These felt fresh that? too. Yes, I've already got that too. Two uh, I got those too. Everything on that end I've gotten already. I got some kosher deals because I need the jar. Well, actually my mom bought those and sent them on with me because I needed the jar. Yeah, that's cold too. Please. Uh, yes. Some dish soap. A laundry detergent. And I got a mat flying around, fabric softener, and ugh, some pub mix. Sage was begging for this, so we got that. And then 25 pound bags, uh, or a 25 pound bag of sugar. All right, y'all, here's all I got from Walmart. They had these, they were regular $4.98, had for $3.50. So, and they're a two pack. And my girls love wearing these shorts, so I got two for, I guess, Paisley. And then two more in hers and Fowler size. I don't know. They'll have to divvy that out. And then I got some for Sage. Got those for her. And these for her. And then we need a hamburger bun. So I got those hamburger buns. Shawler needed some more. Don't pop that. Don't pop that. <laughs> um, Shawler needed some more puppy food for Steely. Don't pop that. I'm done telling you. And then the cats needed some more dry food. We needed some more sweetened condensed milk for homemade ice cream. And then there's Caden's ice cream that he likes to eat. And it's about melted, so we gotta get it put up. That crush just came from the Dollar the Dollar General, Dollar General. for ice cream. And that's what I got at Walmart. Okay, here we go. Here is my Ollie's haul. This is what I picked up at Ollie's. I went for coffee. Got my coffee and then some. That's all I went for was coffee. And here's everything else I got. I got a new rug for the carport because my rug was disgusting out there. It just says welcome y'all and it was $8.99 and they had an extra 15% off of your total price and whatever it is discount that you get for being a member. I got another rug to go in front of the door. It was $1.99 y'all. And then I got another rug and it was $1.99 to go in front of the doors. Try to keep some of this dust off my floors. So I just picked these out. It's just Cocoa Pebbles Crisps. They were, let's see here, $2.49. And then I got this bed. It's like a foam uh, dog bed. It's a dog bed for $15.99. So it's pretty big. Helga needed a new one because she tore hers up. I don't know how many that dog has been through. I don't even know why I keep buying her one, but I did. And then they didn't have the coffee Sage wanted, but she kind of likes the cappuccino mix. So I found this white chocolate caramel for $3.99. And then they had hot cocoa mix, s'mores for $3.99. And then mine and my husband's coffee and Caden, the 80 count dark roast for $19.99. I was out of gallon bags and they had a big box of these for $5.99. I know I'm gonna be needing some tape. So I went ahead and got a six, six rolls of tape, clear tape for $2.49. I got this movie night candy because it was cheap and I'm all about cheap right now. <laughs> so we've got um, just mint M&M's for $2.69, M&M eggs for $2.69, now and later shell shocked for $1.29 and then the trolls sour crunchy crawlers for $1.29. So that's movie night candy. The kids were wanting a bunch of balloons for 
the 4th of July. So I let them get one of these. It's 100 water balloons for $6.99. I'm about out of breath, y'all. Lord have mercy. My dish towels have seen their better days. So I got some new dish towels. I got this one for $1.49. I got a two pack of this one. It says, Welcome to the Farm. And then it just has like a cream color or a tan colored one with some stripes on it for $4.59. And then I got this one. It's a two pack for $3.99. It just has a solid black one and then this one. And then we're getting ready for school. We'll start back in about five weeks. I had a plastic letter tray. These are stackable letter trays. And my plastic one, the cats kept laying in it and they broke it. So I got these metal ones and they were $3.99 a piece. So I just got three of those to put papers and stuff like that in. And that is what we got at Ollie's. Okay, y'all, here is my meal plan for this week. On Sunday, breakfast, we'll be having cinnamon rolls. Lunch will be tacos and rice. Supper will be sloppy joes. Monday is the 4th of July, so I'm going to get up and cook us some sausage gravy, biscuits, and eggs. Lunch, we'll just have pizzas and chips or veggies. And then supper, we are having a barbecue. We are um, smoking some chicken. Um, a lot of our family is coming over to our house, so I may film some of it, but I may not. I don't know. Just depends. But, um, we'll be having smoked chicken, and I picked up some, uh, loaded baked potato, potato salad. And then, um, I'm doing some red, white, and blue deviled eggs. And then I'm gonna do a strawberry poke cake. My mother-in-law is bringing baked beans, and she's providing one of the bags of chicken to, to smoke. My sister-in-law, I can't remember what all she's bringing. She's bringing some stuff, too. And then my mom and my dad, he is going to be smoking some chicken wings. And then he's going to be um, doing the coleslaw. And I think she said something about bringing pies. I'm not for sure. I can't remember. And we're going to be having homemade ice cream, too. So... I think my sister-in-law's doing the drinks and stuff like that, and probably desserts too. I can't remember. We'll just have to see. I'll try to film what we have that day. Okay, Tuesday we are having bagels for breakfast. Lunch will be grilled ham and cheese sandwiches. Supper will be spaghetti and garlic bread. Wednesday, breakfast will be ham, egg, and cheese cups. Lunch will be taquitos and rice. And then supper will be chicken and dumplings. And my kids will be eating at church on Wednesday night, so... Uh, Thursday. Oh, hold on. I got a bug bite in my arm. I'm outside. Ugh. Yeah, and my porch is going to be pressure washed in a couple of days. So, you know, just don't pay no attention to that. Okay, Thursday, breakfast will be homemade muffins. I do the homemade banana chocolate chip muffins. Lunch will be chicken and mac and cheese. Supper will be slow cooker chicken, stuffing, green beans, potatoes, and rolls. Friday, breakfast will be egg and whole. Lunch will be ham and cheese wraps. And supper will be pizza and movie night. Saturday, breakfast will be pancakes and bacon. Lunch will be leftovers because I'm sure we'll have a lot of that. And then supper, I'm going to do white cheesy chicken, enchiladas, and rice. Desserts this week, I have cheesecake, cookies, pie, cake, brownies, banana pudding, and Rice Krispie treats. And when you see my haul, or you've seen my haul already, I'm probably not even going to have to cook any desserts because my husband is going to be home from work this week. He, took, he had some time that he had to take off or he would lose it. So he's off this whole week of the 4th of July, and he said he wanted me to go to Sam's and load up on some junk food. And y'all saw, I loaded up on some junk food. I usually don't buy this stuff, but he told me to go buy it, so I did. Alright, there is my meal plan for the week. Alright y'all, I hope you enjoyed this video, this grocery haul, this gargantuan grocery haul. Grocery haul. It was crazy. Is so crazy and there were tons of people out there today oh my word in some of the rude they were they were so rude it was bad some of them are some of them were still courteous and kind but there were lots of rude people out there today just remember always be kind because you never know what someone's going through and that could be the person that just sets them off and causes them to do something bad Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. I would really appreciate that. If you're new here and you haven't hit the subscribe button, go ahead and hit it. We would love to have you join our YouTube family. I will see y'all in my next one. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.